Hello Pisces, Aries, Cuspers. Welcome to my channel. Um, how are you all doing? I'm going to be doing some quick love messages for you all. See what's going on with Pisces, Aries, Cuspers, in love. Welcome to the newcomers. Um, welcome to the returners. <laughs> hey y'all, how y'all doing? Hope y'all been doing well, fine, okay, enjoying your year. Mm. Thinking positive, being positive, all right? Finding the positive in every situation, okay? Pisces, Aries, Cuspers, in love. Quick messages for Pisces, Aries, Cuspers, in love, please. All right, you have Divine Feminine here. True love, this connection is divine. Mutual, symbiotic. This is a beneficial and balanced connection. Both partners have the same feelings, ideas, values, and share life goals here. And you all got lessons of Mars. Purely physical, sexual attraction. Fire and passion to run fast and burn fast without other elements here, okay? So, to start off, um, Pisces, Aries, Cuspers, you could be a Divine Feminine or dealing with your Divine Feminine here, okay? Or, yeah, this could be you. You could be the Divine Feminine here, all right? Uh, but we have Divine Feminine, True Love, Mutual symbiotic and lessons of Mars here. All right. So you could be dealing with somebody that you feel is your true love or that is your true love. This is your true love because this is a mutual symbiotic. Um, this could be a connection that is purely, uh, purely physical sexual attraction. Okay. You all could be needing to build in other areas. But let's see what's going on. Pisces, Aries, Cuspers. Alright. Divine Feminine here, you got rejection. This rejection is actually divine protection here. Okay, so um, if you're the Divine Feminine here, you could feel as though um, you've been rejected here, or you could have rejected someone here. Okay. Oh my goodness. All right, what fell on the floor is balance. All right, so one person is giving too much in this relationship, okay? So there needs to be some balance here. You have time apart. Some distance will help bring clarity here, okay? So for some of you all, you could, um, there could be some time away from your person. You could not be communicating as much with your person, all right? You all could not be, um, on good terms right now for some of you all but this distance will help bring clarity here okay and you have twin flame so this is a divine counterpart connection all right so we have rejection balance time apart and twin flame here all right so in order to gel this connection there needs to be some balance here and the time apart the distance that you all are having um, will help bring some clarity here okay 
Let's keep going. See. Pisces, Aries, Cuspers. So with this true love, you have balance. Okay. This is a balanced connection. Both parties have the same feelings, ideas, values, and shared goals here. But it could be uh, there's some distance, okay, between the two here. All right. All right, let's see. Okay, with this Divine Feminine and this rejection. Divine Feminines, uh, maybe you need to start rehashing or living in the past or worrying about the future. You need to seize every minute and engage in the present moment. That's all that matters here, okay? So, um, it could just be thinking about things from the past that, you know, is hindering you from move forward, moving forward, okay? All right. Okay, with this true love and balance, you have health and healing. Take care of your body. Take time to simply breathe deeply and relax. Walk in nature, meditate, eat a healthier diet. Small changes make a big difference here. All right, so there needs to be some balance here, okay? And the balance that is brought forth, okay, within this connection will help bring health and healing here, okay? With this time apart, mutual symbiotic and time apart, you have letting go. So if something is meant to be, it will be. Stop putting your life on hold while waiting for it to happen. Let whatever it is go and move on with your life, okay? And you also have collaboration. So it's, you could be rehashing things from the past, okay? That is hindering health and healing here. There are some things that... It's hindering you from moving forward, so you're needing to let it go, whether it's a person or, you know, things here, okay? It could be some certain type of collaboration, all right, um, that you're needing to let go of, okay? All right, let's get to Angel Tarot to see what's going on. Pisces, Aries, Cuspers. Quick messages. Let's see. With this divine feminine rejection and the mindfulness, you have the king of air. All right. So you need to speak your mind with confidence. Seek out professional advice. Balance mental and emotional considerations here. All right. Okay. You have the four of water with the balance. Okay. And the health and healing. So, for some of you all, somebody could be missing out on an opportunity, feeling discontent, maybe feeling a bit bored here. You're needing to open your eyes to the possibilities of what's to come here, okay? All right. Okay, with this mutual symbiotic time apart and letting go, you have the magician here. All right, so you are ready. You have the resources or the ability to manifest them. Life is magical here. Okay, so know that you got the magician. You can manifest, create the life you are wanting here. All right, so let go of what is no longer serving you. If this, if you are, if there's some time apart or some distance between you and your person, allow this time to heal here. 
um, stop living in the past. Okay, open your eyes to the possibilities. All right, and you all have the wheel here. Okay, so a time of positive change, a situation suddenly moves forward. Fortune is on your side. Okay, all right, y'all. So I salute the divinity in you all. I am sending you all love, light, and positivity. Thank you all for joining me. I love you all, and I hope you enjoyed your quick messages. Okay, see y'all next time. Bye.